Hey everyone, today we're doing a head to head comparison between ConvertKit and ActiveCampaign. These two platforms are both solid choices, but they're built for different types of users. So let's see what sets them apart. ConvertKit is tailored for creators, people who are building audiences through content, uh, whether it's blogging, uh, podcasting or online courses. It's all about simplicity and efficiency. You've got powerful tagging and segmentation, easy to create email sequences, and a really clean interface that keeps uh, things straightforward. Active Campaign, on the other hand, is on another level when it comes to features. It's designed for businesses that are ready to scale and need more advanced tools. You get complex automations, uh, a built-in uh, CRM, and a huge library of integrations. So if your business has more complex needs like uh, multiple product lines or customer journeys, ActiveCampaign can handle that with ease. So let's compare some specific features. ConvertKit's strength lies in its simplicity and focus on creators. It offers tagging and segmentation tools that are easy to use, making it a breeze to organize uh, your audience. Uh, Active Campaign, uh, however, provides more advanced automation capability. This makes it better suited for uh, businesses with more intricate workflows and uh, customer management needs. So, which one should you choose? If you're a creator, uh, who values simplicity and ease of use, and ConvertKit might be the way to go. But if you're managing a growing business and need more uh, advanced tools, then Active Campaign is definitely worth considering. And if you're curious about Active Campaign, there's a free trial available. Just click the link in the description. So both platforms have their strengths, so choose the one that best fits your needs. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.